Western United have only played seven games so far. They've got three in hand on today's opposition and they can knock them out of the top six if they win this game. They'll jump in and the Wanderers will fall out. Here goes Abini. Numbers arriving in the middle for Bernie right Abini. Wilmering will keep it inside the 18-yard box and hang it up for Abini again. And now to place it. What a save by Curto, who flung out the right boot, I fancy, after a deflection on the Doran shot. And now Abini hunting around at that near post. Took a little deflection here from Dorans, and Curto stays alive. Here's Dorans from the corner routine. Oh, scorpion kick kind of action from Jordan Much. And it went just wide. Ryan Scott was an onlooker. If this is on target, he scores. And goes all Riley McGree on us. Diamante hangs it up and the header on target. Great scramble by Margush to deny to Moki Imai. And that's what you want to do. You want to head it back to where it comes from because that almost generates that power. Ongoing on the far side. And now the Wanderers inside the area. Abini to Troisi. Teeing up Wilmering. And great reactions from Ryan Scott to keep it out and deny Wilmering his first A-League goal. Oh, Skadatis, big error. Jordan Mutt gifted his first goal in Australia. Shocking mistake from Jerry Skadatis, but Jordan Mutt doesn't care. He latched onto it, fired it past the backup goalkeeper, Ryan Scott, who didn't stand a chance, and Western Sydney lead in Ballarat. Late challenge in midfield there. The advantage is accruing that. Tarius in a central area. Clever little drag back, and the shot is a beauty. And the equaliser from Dylan Tarius. They're celebrating in the stands, but they're celebrating a non-goal. It rebounded back around the back of the net. Just watch the ball here. Margush dived, and it went around the left side of the post, hit the stanchion, goes into the back of the net. Diamante delivers, man down in the box. Was Barisha blocked off? He's adamant that should be a penalty. Look it, look it, look it, look it, look it, look it, look at how he's grabbing it. Why you guys don't look it? Why you guys don't look it? But they need to see it. I can see it clearly. I don't understand this. It's Diamante. Another tussle. It's an uphill battle, but what a ball lifted in. And the header kept out by Margush brilliantly. What I was saying about having someone else in that position to score that goal, because that header was straight at the goalkeeper. Anything to the left, right of him would have been a goal. What a chance here for the Wanderers to see it. Back off the post from Kwame Yabola. And out for just the goal kick. You can see what Bruce Kamau thought was a better option. He's back in Melbourne. Oh, God, back in Melbourne. He'd be pleased with this. And Kenny Miller is uh, one from one calling the shots in the technical area in Australia. The Wanderers were vulnerable at the bottom of that top six, but not anymore. A precious three points on the road to jump to third on the A-League ladder as Jordan Much celebrates a starting debut with his first goal in the A-League. An indifferent performance by Western United on their home deck in the absence of the suspended duo, Tommy Uzgok and Victor Sanchez, who will return next game. At full time, it's the Wanderers 1, Western United nil.